Hello friends, in this video I am going to show how to show animated menu using floating action button. So make sure to watch the video till the end. If you are new here, please subscribe my channel for more helpful flutter videos. By default we can perform only single option on this floating action button. If you want to perform multiple action using floating action button, we need to open menu on click of it. So in this video I am going to show how to add animated menu on click of floating action button. To animate the menu using floating action button, I will be using floating action bubble package. This package supports Android, iOS, web and desktop application. I have already added its dependency in pubspec.yaml file. Now let's make that side changes. So instead of this floating action button widget, I will be using floating action bubble widget. So let's make the change. Here you can see floating action bubble widget. Using item property of this widget, I have added menu options within this widget. So for each menu option, I use bubble widget. And within this bubble widget, I use property to customize the menu. So here you can see this bubble widget for setting menu that's shown here. Beside this, we have shown the icon and the label using these properties. Likewise, I have added three menu options here for this profile and home. Then I have attached this animation to this animation property to show hide this menu on click of this floating action button. Here you can see in on press callback handler, this animation is changed using this animation controller. So on press that is getting hidden and another click of this button, the menu options are shown. You can change the color of this floating action button using this background color property. You can change icon color and icon of the floating action button. In on press callback handler of the menu option, just call the animation dot reverse to hide this menu option like this. That's all for animating menu on floating action button. You can find this code on GitHub. Link is given in the description. If you have any issue or suggestion, please comment below. Thanks for watching the video. If you like this video, please click on like button and do not forget to subscribe my channel.